never wore top of this. Yeah, I think it works. I haven't exercised at all on this trip. <laughs> I ain't at this strip shop. Just touched down in London town. Wow. I think we're in Brussels Court right now. Very nice neighborhood in London. <laughs> you got it and all. Russell Square is where we got oh, off. Oh shit, I don't know. We got off at Russell Square, so whatever neighborhood that is. Excuse my dry skin, y'all. I just got off the plane. And we're about to go find some breakfast. Some real proper breakfast. So we have made it to Andrews because I just could not keep walking to the place we were going to go to because y'all I am literally I don't know if y'all can see I'm shaking I'm so hungry I've only had like what did I eat yeah candy like I've only had candy and salmon and salmon at like seven o'clock yesterday and now I'm having this coffee I am dying mommy. I'm about to try to try this English breakfast to see um, if I like it hopefully it does come with mushrooms yeah wow I would not put all of this together but it looks interesting thank you not bad I feel like it's just missing some proper hot sauce and jam. So I got my hot sauce, y'all. Yeah, so we're on our way back to our Airbnb. The lady finally responded and said that we can come and drop our stuff off. So that's what we're doing right now. And um, I don't know if you guys have seen my vlogs, but in the vlog, previous I was talking about how I was vaping and how I was like kind of addicted to it y'all oh my god when I tell y'all I have gotten a cough bro I've had a cough for like a week now and it's just now starting to go away just started drinking like cough medicine but this cough has been really interfering with my everyday life and now I can't even look at a vape I can't even look at a vape I just want to be an advocate for don't Vape, not vaping. <laughs> even my voice, I feel like it's a little bit deeper now. Yeah, it, is. <sighs> it is, babe. It's so, like, man. It's okay. Love those vibes. So, y'all, this is like a little deli for them, I guess. And I just think it's so interesting that they have wine and like little knickknacks. You can eat your fruits and veggies. Yeah, you get your fiction. Yeah. Beer, your yeah. Hey. <laughs> they are so cute. So we just dropped our luggage off and we can't come back until three because I guess they have to like clean the place and stuff. We're about to go get some beer and then just walk around, I guess, see what we can find. And then honestly, y'all, I can feel me and Connor were saying when we was eating our breakfast, we can feel a crash coming on. I can feel it in the air. For real. People are really staring at me, but you know, it's so crazy. Like I feel more comfortable here just vlogging in front of any and everyone because I'm like never gonna see these people again. <laughs> oh, they're going telephone booth. <laughs> There's a lot of haircut places around here too, y'all. Look at they birds, y'all. Even they birds more respectful. Look at that. They be out of the way. New York birds be all in your face. Like these birds. All right, y'all. So you already know I gotta go thrifting. And we're all on our way to this one thrift shop that I found, but on the way there, we found this place called Wow Retro. So I'm about to go in here and see what this is a belt, baby. Step one. It's looking like my type of a jam already. Ooh, it smells like a thrift store. Yes. The price is looking like 30 pounds, 20 pounds. Okay, they ain't playing with you over here, y'all. 15 pounds. I did like this one little sweater here for, but it's 20 pounds. Uh, uh, I don't think it's a bad price, but I just don't like this little thing right here. <laughs> I don't really like that. 
but so this is sick but really itchy really really itchy but sick I think it works. So I'm about to go get my nails done. I can't wait to see what a manicure in London looks like. But my nails are so weak, y'all. Like I told them, I'm like, my nails are weak. I just need a buff and like clear polish, but they look so bad right now. So I'm gonna have them do that for me. And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like after. Just above. So running off fumes you guys, but as I said, we have some time before we can go to our Airbnb. So I'm about to pop into another thrift shop. This one is called Pop Boutique. Another recommendation. And this one looks like it has even more stuff. They're like dad jeans on you. They're like your uncle jeans. Oh, no, no, no. It's your chatty poo poo. Oh my god, look at this place. Y'all, look at this Airbnb. This is it. Oh, this is the most beautiful place I've ever been in. Thank you. Yeah. So I'm going to take this one also so this one. What's that? I'm going to take one. What's that? Okay. 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 Sounds good. Thank you. Do you know if um, there's a Wi-Fi information somewhere? Y'all, this is insanely good. This is the bathroom. I'm on the prowl for jeans, so hopefully I find some jeans. Um, I'm looking for lotion too, y'all. Oh, look at all this crust. Y'all, I think this is a little Swedish area because it was that brand that was Swedish and then across the street was Nudie. And oh, what is this? It is Universal Works. Go ahead, y'all. Oh, hello. Good. Yeah, how are you? So I just popped in here, y'all. Universal Works. This brand is from Nottingham. Hundred percent. Your new wool. Wow. A peaky blind up. It's me. And what is this then? Axel. Excel. Oh, this Axel Erigato. I've been wanting a pair of their shoes. Kinda. They said Yeezy who? <laughs> I see already see all sorts of shoes already in these shoes. Like there's Adidas, like specials over there. Like, yeah. Uh, the running shoes. Yeah, but they just so cool they looking. Do. They always sold out too on Essence or like in the States, they always sold out. But I have made it to all like I said. Oh, 
on the way to meet AA Stash Archives. This is where they had that big event yesterday event? for the Queen. What? Buckingham? No, that's not here, <laughs> but. Alright. Let's figure out how to. Let's keep your shirt tucked in, tuck it into your underwear. It was annoying me because it was just not tucked. See, like the London Bridge is going up. See. Are you sure this is the London Bridge, guys? In the end, we're all going on. on what now? You like meats? Yeah. Say hi to the vlog, guys. <laughs> I am at this thrift shop. I cannot believe this is my Friday. I found my first pair of leather pants, custom shirts. <laughs> So this sums up the food in London. <laughs> so I just met up with Ayo, which you guys saw. And it was so great, so amazing. He brought us to this area. What is the area called, babe? Brick Lane. Brick Lane. Bruh. Brick Lane is where it's at, baby. I just found my first pair of leather pants, which I'm gonna show you guys. They fit me so freaking perfectly. Like, if I would have seen these in New York, it would have been at least like $200, like insane. One nine for local. So this is the area, y'all. If you come over in this area in London, like you're gonna see all the little vintage shops, but, oh, she is the best, darling. Yes, yes, yes. Connor is literally about to kill me, but I had to change my clothes really quick because I just did not like my outfit. And I changed into this, and I still don't think I like my outfit. <laughs> morning guys so I think I left y'all like in distress because I couldn't find out what I was gonna wear this is what I ended up wearing last night and I like the look I just wish honestly which I cannot talk I just wish that honestly my pants were a little bit shorter for this look but anyway I feel like I'm inspired by my surroundings sometimes and I feel like people in London they kind of you know they be more casual so I was like, yeah, I'm gonna be more casual so I can like kind of fit in, but you know, still be me. Um, yeah, we went to dinner to this place. I forget what it's called. It's something duck. I'm gonna insert it here. But it was so nice, y'all. It was like, you get to, uh, like a 360 view of the city. It was so beautiful. And what was so surprising to me was it wasn't so expensive. Like I feel like a restaurant in New York or even Chicago that looked like this would have been like, the prices would have been way more expensive. Like the food, well, I would rate it like an eight out of 10. Like it wasn't like, oh my God, so amazing, but it was decent food. Like it was, it was, it was good. So yeah, I'm about to get up, get dressed, and we're gonna go to Selfridges. I went to Our Legacy yesterday, y'all. And I was kind of not like underwear. I just wish it was like more selection for women, I guess. I was looking for these jeans. So I'm gonna go to Selfridges and see if they have them. Cause they told me that Selfridges is a stock is for them. So as well as all of these guys, I'm gonna pop it up here as I wrote it down in my notes. Um, Iraq t-shirt. It's by this artist in New York. I believe he's a skateboarder. And yeah, I got it at Dover Street Market. 
undercover jacket because it gets a little cold. My same bracelet that I wear all the time by All Blues. I don't take it off ever. Trousers, front general store, and then my Art Legacy Dirties is the look. I'm covering this down. We're taking a different route. Ooh, I love that Cross here. Oh, Cross here. A lot to see in London, though. I'm loving the, the scenery and how clean it is. Oh my god, I love how clean it is here. We're definitely more than halfway there. Okay, perfect. No, it's in Soho. Is that the area? It's kind of scary. I'm recording you. So no, this is the Cinema and Selfridges. Is this Selfridges? This, this is the whole thing. This whole thing is, Sierra. Yeah. This whole thing is Selfridges. I think so. I that's thought what... it would be yellow. Well, maybe that's it up there. I see a yellow yeah, sign. That's what okay, Sierra. Yeah, I, I don't think know. So, then. That you... makes more sense. I've only heard of Selfridges like since yesterday. I have no idea. <laughs> this is Jacques Mousse. Yeah. Jacques Mousse. Yeah. Okay, so I see it. It's all of this. All right. They couldn't help me with that door. Mm -hmm. So the sales associate here was telling me that this bag is heavy and I picked it up and it is definitely heavy. <laughs> but it is cute. But if I was to go for anyone, it would definitely be the classic Jody baby. But I will want silver hardware. This is very nice. Ooh. This is good for travel. Yeah. I if I was a trap. But that looks so big on my little bitty body. It does. <laughs> I haven't exercised at all man. this trip. Take a jog and soup. Reminds me of um it's a show called Squid Game. <laughs> That's both big. Whoa, this is kind of sick and cozy, isn't it? Look at that. Oh, shit. They got too good. They got too good. Uh, too good, I believe it's a Korean. Wait, it's too good, literally. It's giving me like a Yoji, like margella type of a vibe that's why i like too good i feel like it's very classic like those brands this cotton is so nice too I look good stuff. you will look good it's like really easy a little wells bonner moment this is a medium though i feel like i would definitely need a small that's very beautiful too I love the structure of it, how boxy it is up top. And then like more of like an A, not an A-line, but just like straight body. Subtle double breasted detail. And the buttons. Oh, okay, well. I see you, sis. Yeah. I'm pretty sure they have Martin Rose, they have to. So these caps are so cool, but they are not for sale. It has a tag on the inside <laughs> that says that. But get into it, it's kind of sick. I don't think it's that practical, but definitely sick. Should we start over from the beginning, pretend like you just walked up for the first time? <laughs> Let's try. <No. laughs> 
Um, but the range, the texture is so nice, actually. Okay, so I'm at the Selfridges tree section, and I have actually seen these advertised online, these little samplers of all of them. But I'm so happy that she told me that you could buy these guys because I really only like these three. <laughs> Do they have names? So, Neon Garden, Santal Greenery, and Fleur de Mont. These three are my favorite. So, I actually don't really like all of these. But this is so nice for just like, I think it's like 45 pounds. So, this is my first time seeing Frankie Shop actually in real life. I like love the way they silhouettes look like people. It looks really classy. This is a nice trench. These, I don't know. I don't like pants where you can just see the polyester, which is so vividly. But it really looks like it's a nice fitted trouser for $195. And then these are the little sets, the infamous little short and like little boxy shirt sets that I see everyone in. It's nice to see this stuff in person, you know? Okay, I feel like my darkness has been low. We'll get into this look right here with the freaking tractors. Oh. Silk. Oh. This is from the brand Low Classic. And I kind of really like this blazer. Okay, Steve Harvey. <laughs> I am the Steve Harvey now. It's kind of sick though. The material is really nice. I just love how structured it is. It looks so sick. But also, it's like stuff like this, like you can thrift it, you know? But. Yeah. It is really good. I'm waiting for these Our Legacy jeans. They don't have an Our Legacy section. She was telling me I think they're waiting on the new collection. But they have jeans in the back, jeans in the back, jeans in the back. Um, I want to try them on. They didn't have my jeans. Right, so we have gone to Selfridges, and I don't know what I expected. I expected for it to be, I don't know, like smaller and like very like less hypey type brands. Like I didn't expect to see like Paige there for some reason. And yeah, but I'm happy I went. I got the little Dries since, so I don't even have a freaking Selfridges bag. I have a Dries bag though. Um, but yeah, I think it was a really good deal for those scents. But the only thing is, I don't even smell it anymore. I guess when I do this, I do it. That's the thing with scents though. Like, even if they water-based, oil-based, I feel like a lot of them, once you spread on you, you really don't smell it after like 10 minutes. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Do you smell it on me? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. So we're off for burgers. Hopefully it's good. So y'all, it's full 12. And I'm exhausted. We went to Selfridges. We had a good little burger at this burger place. And now it's nap time. I'm gonna have a nap. Whoa. See you guys later. <laughs> I never knew a thing existed. I always said like, man, I wish it was Starbucks with all the reds or any type of candy with all like red and pink candy. <gasps> oh my gosh. It's all red, y'all. Oh my gosh, this is like the best pack. I have to get more of these before I leave. But yeah, this is exciting. Candy haul, and then I found this sprinkles and cream. Oh my gosh, usually I just get Oreos and cream. Again, never knew if they existed. This is my second one. These are really good, strawberries and cream. I don't know if I showed you guys the Airbnb when it was clean, because remember we came in here to drop our bags off, but this is our Airbnb, y'all. If it wasn't clear the first time, I'm just obsessed with this place. Like, I am so obsessed. Like, I feel like a place like this in New York is like millions and millions of dollars. This is probably millions of dollars, I don't know. But it's just so freaking beautiful and honestly, just like a dream house. <laughs> and the person who um, owns it or lives here, she is an architecture teacher. And I asked her if she designed this house, and she said no, but all of the trimmings are her. Aesthetic-wise of the house, this is her. I love the drapes too, so beautiful. Um, but yeah, 
and the table too. But it's the kitchen for me, y'all. It's really the freaking kitchen. I just love it. And then she has like a little courtyard right here. And she made me tea yesterday. Her name is Lisa. It was the best tea ever. It was the most fanciest tea I've ever seen in my life. I'm like, I can see why, you know, the wabi sabi, the whole tea technique is a thing because it's so, I can see it being just so therapeutic to make the tea. But yeah, I had fresh green tea in this little guy. It was water in here. And then this little cup for the tea and her artwork, her cups are so pretty. CG. I feel like I know that, but I'm not sure. Not CG, but very pretty um, tea. London has been so great, you guys. Um, we are heading to Amsterdam bright and early in the morning. So I'm gonna be at you guys then. I'm so excited for Amsterdam. Um, yeah, I'm so excited. <sighs> Good boy. Good boy. Mulan got a haircut. Mulan. Look at Mulan. He's so pretty. Uh, I don't know if y'all have noticed, but I've had a cough due to this damn vape, but it's starting to subside. My skin is starting to look better. Thank you, Jesus. And we are off to Amsterdam. We're almost all packed. I am going to wear my boots because they are clunky and too heavy. Bye, Mulan. Bye, Mulan. Bye, baby. Oh, now you say you've been barking. Bye, London. It's been great. Yeah. I got it. 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 I got it